What's up everyone? There's been some confusion about the uh, transfer between the Vital Bracelet and the app, which I have right here. Um, so I just wanted to do a quick video showing the, the exact transfer process. I have my DIMMs um, right here just in case I need one. Um, but I just wanted to show like the in video form um, the, the process itself. So I'm going to transfer my Paildramon to the app. Uh, we're going to go to the app screen or the app um, transfer uh, menu. It says touch. Okay. And uh, the app is now ready to receive. Scanned. And he's good. Payo German is in the app now. Yeah, so he's in the app. Um. <laughs> He's in the app. I'll do whatever you can do, whatever. Um, but I'm I'm just gonna show that transferring him back to the app right away, or sorry, back to the VB um, right away does not require the dim to be inserted. So there's a notice here that says, um, I don't know the exact translation, but it says you will need the dim. Um, I'm pretty sure it only means you you need it if you've replaced the Digimon. Um, that was in here. So if you if you load something from backup or if you download a different uh, Digimon from the app into the VB and then try to to download the Spy Ultraman, uh, you will need the DIM. So let let me just show how it works. Um, sending him directly back without without doing anything. So uh, this reads DIM card check. Uh, this is a special mission confirmation. Blah 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 items. <laughs> So now uh, it's ready to send. So this is this is telling the DIM which DIM card, or I'm sorry, this is telling the vital bracelet which DIM card it needs um, to be loaded. Since that DIM card has already been loaded, it's the most recent one, it will go straight away to the touch screen. And now this screen um, is for the app to check that the correct DIM is loaded. And it is, and now this is the final confirmation to send Paiyodramon back. No dim needed. He's back. Yeah. So I'm gonna do it. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna send him back again, um, and then we're gonna go ahead and send a different uh, Digimon. So I'm just sending him straight back to the app. Okay, he's back in that. And we're going to load one of my Digimon from um, the backup. So we're going to get uh, my Omegamon Zwart out. And we're going to try to send him back to the uh, Vital Bracelet. So now it says I will need Black Roar because I this Omegamon is from Black Roar. Um, so it's going to do... Jeez, it's going to do the... Okay, there we go. It's going to do the DIM card check. App, or app menu. I'm going to send it back. Or it's going to check uh, which DIM is loaded. So the the Vital Bracelet has Ancient Warriors loaded. So now it requires the Black Roar DIM. So I have it right here. I'm going to insert it. And wait. <laughs> so... <clears throat> So what I'm trying to say is that it, it the Vital Bracelet does not require the DIM to be inserted if the most recent Digimon on the VB was the same one that you're sending. Um, so as you can see, Paiyodramon went to the app. I sent him back right away with, with no DIM. Um, it's because the environment data from the DIM is already loaded onto the VB and it does it doesn't need to be loaded again now if you had um, say two okay now it's accepted take it out and now black roar is the black roar data is loaded onto the dim the app is checking that the correct data is loaded okay and now Zwart is ready to be sent And Zwart is now 
on the VB. Cool. So we're going to do something. Um, I'm going to put them into backup. So Zwart's going in backup. Okay, and then we're going to get Pyildramon back up. Pyildramon is out. And we're going to try to send him back to the app as well. So let's do that. This is the dim card check. So this is, again, this is the app, or sorry, this is the VB or this is the app telling the VB which DIM it needs to be loaded. So now it requires Ancient Warriors to be loaded. So we we go ahead and load it. So that first screen, the DIM card check, it is the app telling the VB which DIM needs to be loaded, if any. Um, so if that data that it sends about which DIM is required, it matches what's already on here, then it won't need it at all, as demonstrated from the, the first transfer. Okay, it's almost done. There we go. So we take out the, the DIM, and now this this next scan is telling the app the this is the vb telling the app that it has the correct data and then this final one is what sends the digimon over so now pi userman is back <clears throat> so again if you you do not need to insert the dim every single time as long as you are just transferring back and forth um, from the app. Um, you're not loading any other Digimon. Even if it's a different Digimon from the same DIM, um, you will need, if, if you load that into your active uh, your active slot, even from backup, um, you will need to reload or insert the correct DIM um, of whatever's coming from from the VB. But if, you, if, if it's just, if, like you saw, if, Ancient Warriors was the last thing on the V inactive on the VB. Uh, you transfer it to the app, transfer it back. You do not need a DIM. Um, so just wanted to to clear that out. Uh, you do not need to insert the DIM on. Um, you don't need to insert when it's on this screen. You only need to insert when the vital bracelet asks you for it. Um, even if it has, even if it says on here, well. It doesn't say it right now, but when it says on here, like you will need this dim, you do not need it unless, um, again, unless a different dim was loaded onto this. Um, so just, I hope that, that that clears up some issues, some long running issues with the transfer process and like visualizes it so, so it's clear. <clears throat>